Oi, oi, lads. This is the meta breaker, though. Give me Samut Vizier of Nactaman. Give me four Arc Light Phoenix. Seed of Hopium. Looting. Harvest. Impulse is okay. Oh wait, my seed is gonna brick. My seed is bad. It's actually the worst card I could possibly play. It's gonna mill two instants and sorceries, and even if I do mill a phoenix, it's gonna put it into my hand. Which is, I mean, that's kind of awkward, no? This goes in for sure. Oh, iteration, yeah. Ancestral anger, no, but iteration is sick. Seek a card with mana value two or less, and a card with mana value three or greater. Nice. Then uh, channel my ass. And I guess, I guess Jarso, right? Can you really play Jarso though? This isn't actually even the best Jarso deck. We've only got one set of two mana cards. I guess we can replace uh, Seed of Hope with another set of twos, which would be... What exactly? Oh yeah, Molten Impact is uh, also a card, yes. Very, that's very true. I don't think we can play four of these things, but you know, we can go... Go three each, I believe, and then I guess you can go. I don't really like this card, but it makes sense to play it. One, one lightning axe, one spike field. All right, chat. Who gets to be the card art? Samut, Jarso, Phoenix, or Gigantha? <clears throat> Samut. We we also need Samut art. All right, one or two? One or two? It's always a democracy here with regards to art. Two because it's bad. <laughs> it's true. Two, uh, actually, do you know what? I quite like the two. Trying a new attempt today, chat, when you reverse psychology. Oh my God, the deck just looks less powerful now that I've changed this art. It actually makes the deck look more janky. It's crazy how much difference the art makes. <laughs> Ten seconds ago, this was a historic deck. Now it's a historic brew. Yikes. All right, all right. <clears throat> Got a nice mix of cards here. The food again. I mean, I really want lands, chat, but I've got a feeling I'm going to need these impulses. Go land me. a top for sure. That's a top for sure. Cha-cha again. Cha-cha now, y'all. Summit. Draw a card. <clears throat> okay. Pretty nice. That's a no blocks. <laughs> I 
Wait, why didn't I just block if I was going to attack? <laughs> Fuck! I forgot why I didn't block. What an idiot. <clears throat> At least we've got a new, a new Samut. Do, 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 do. I want a new... I did not mean to place that as a land. <laughs> uh, okay. Give me a whoops on that one, brother. <clears throat> Bro, how do we get these phoenixes into the goddamn graveyard? It's not. I mean, it's hard to get my Phoenix out, but the rest of the deck is doing okay. <laughs> How do you get Phoenix into the goddamn graveyard? I guess I, I'm supposed to draw, like, you know, a looting or maybe hit a Phoenix off of your channel or once in a while. <laughs> okay. Mysterious blood illness in. Barrage in, strangle it in, axe out, line up out, go. I guess you should probably preemptively bring your grudges in though. You've got hearses to kill, and at, at worst, you can at least use them on a sentinel, right? It's not the end of the world. <clears throat> they, they might have rest in peace, actually, instead of hearse. Okay, fine. <laughs> but it is kind of sick that you've got main deck hate hate. It's, and you've got to see you too. Is it only faithless to discard? Uh, looting discards, channeler surveils, iteration discards. So, I, like, I don't really understand what we're not playing here. Got to cut something. I, I guess you cut the harvest, right? Keep the line up the shot. They're both draw spells anyway.
opponent is cheating. <clears throat> Dude, Esper Sentinel is just an unfair card, isn't it? Hey, brother, any blocks? Okay. <laughs> Can't say I'm too surprised. So lucky, so lucky. Do you run any faithless lootings? I run tons of faithless lootings, tons. <clears throat> Alright, classic historic there. Not, not very close. And I, I don't think we need to keep lightening the axe in. We might need to play more barrages, I've only got two, but... I think you could probably add a third one to your sideboard, right? I can't believe opponents so high rated with humans when when barrage exists now. Maybe people just haven't added it to their sideboard yet in historic. Maybe people are not adapting yet. A faithless looting! Oh my goodness, what a blessing. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, ting, tang, walla, walla, bang, bang. Dude, it's so much easier when they don't have an Esper Sentinel, huh? Jesus. Any lands? Right, putting all my removal spells in the graveyard. Feels kind of bad, bro. Any lands? <laughs> Jarsal over some, I think, because Jarsal can maybe f flip our channelers here. We need a creature in the graveyard. Okay, rip. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah. I play fourth land. I pass. Oh, I have Cretus land that I need in the graveyard, huh? <clears throat> Yo, bruh. Surveil all removal. What the f I'm looking for a goddamn land?
Bro, please just put a land in my fucking graveyard. Jesus. Thank you. Dude, where, where's my phoenix? Where, where is my phoenix? I just cast like 10 spells. Wait, I, I cast two spells. Ah, understood, understood. I, in fact, cast two spells. <laughs> Channeler Summit to discard your phoenix or just cast the phoenix and go. <clears throat> I how is it so hard to get the phoenix out of the deck? I'd like to think opponent can't kill me after this Coco, but it's not impossible, right? Not impossible. Do, 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 do. Two, five, seven damage. <clears throat> this should be fine. Third Coco? Huh? So lucky. I think it's not enough though. Okay, I would say that's a good start. I'd love for my Phoenix deck to actually bring some Phoenixes out though. But it feels like that would improve it even further. Metalhead 35. All right, we've got a weird Gruel curve deck here. Tragedy! This iteration is going to easily give us an untapped land and a jar so. <laughs> The new card made for Bard class? I don't know if it's for Bard class, man. There's not that many haste creatures in Grow Bard. A few, of course, but... Summit wants most of your creatures to be haste, right? Or at least to, to bring, bring in creatures that are uh, hasting. You know, like you would be fine with Adeline, I suppose. Nahiri might be historic playable. That's one that we could maybe look into trying. The, the problem with Nahiri is that she's affinity for equipment, right? So she, she takes away your... Ability to play Loris, which is pretty freaking lame. Yep. 
Another good deck for our sideboard board wipe. Bro, can this opponent wake the fuck up, man? Jesus Christ. Don't don't queue up a game of magic if you're not gonna fucking pay attention to it. Just do something else. In the land since you shuffle anyway. No, the, the land's still on top. This is seek. <laughs> this one can go though. So the, the iteration is going to discard this phoenix at the end of this turn. <laughs> Obviously, we're not going to be goblins with no removal spells, so we're, we're hoping to draw one ace ASAP. The phone gamer. The brothers listen to too many pots and pans smashing against each other. They're just the brains fucking melted. <laughs> Stop hating metal. How can I not hate metal? Well, opponent, the uh, opponent's the one that listens to it. Look what happens to you if you just like expose your ears to that noise. <laughs> the opponent has ruined metal. This Jarso's not even that good because I don't have any one mana cards somehow. <laughs> We're pretty dead. I don't think we're going to play Jarso too often and not get a one mana card out because, I mean, we do have 4, 8, 12, 16, 20 of them in the deck. Unfortunately, it's 20 of our 45 bottom cards. Or 19, sorry. <laughs> Still need to play the Jarso though because we're going we're gonna to lose it at the end of this turn. And we can we can take a chump with a channeler, and the Jarso can rebuy the channeler at some point. Bro, this opponent has taken six minutes to take three turns of magic. I fucking I'm gonna lose my goddamn mind. <laughs> We are extremely dead. Uh, I hope we draw our Vampire's Vengeance after sideboard. And I hope we draw at least one other card that costs one mana.
You can count on me. Where are my one mana instants and sorceries? This is madness. Reveal yourselves. I guess this is uh, <clears throat> regular Phoenix issues. They can happen. They have been known to happen. <laughs> When Pashlight Mons or another goblin dies, deal one to any target. Okay. <laughs> Spells? This is crazy, man. Why have I only got a forest available? What if I draw a removal spell? <laughs> Sheesh! It's a bit, bit of a throw here, chat. Whoops. All for all to save one life on your carcass and forest. You're gonna lose to that man. This is an easy case of simply use your one remaining mana to kill the Pasha like Mons and therefore win the video game. You're sick of the opponent. Me too, a little bit. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose this game to that Knarto Capper man. What a disaster! Discard a card, then draw a card. I mean, I guess just start yourself off with a little boink. <laughs> what is it that I need in the graveyard, man? Instant and preferably another creature. Okay, fine. Because once we bring the Phoenix out here, our channelers are actually going to be back to 1-1s, one -one, so you got to keep that in mind. What is opponent doing? Bro, don't talk to me about what is the opponent doing. This the opponent's on fucking Mars, man. What is going on? Brother's on another planet. Doop, 
Channel is gonna die anyway. Yeah, I should. Uh, that, that's why I used my instant, right? Where they die. Get my extra surveils. Yeah, I'm so I'm, I apologize for my hate, but my opponent is currently uh, fucking with my vibes, and it's upsetting me. Samut Phoenix. Ooh, baby. Combo. Uh, uh, uh. Draw three, baby. <clears throat> that is actually really cool. It's actually very cool. <clears throat> Okay, I liked it, I liked it. Man, is Barrage still playable against them? It would be a little bit weird, I understand. But would it be wrong? That's a very different question. Imagine not killing Snoop at the end of your turn. I did the man. <clears throat> I did you crazy cat. I mean, Sanctuary seems good, right? You force... Uh, they can't really kill my creatures, they have to just go face. With all their pings. Although maybe if they go... F if they're forced to go face, I'm more likely to lose. <laughs> Might be one mana lose the game. I love that the deck can play four, you line up the shots, so you're just you're just pre-prepared for the hate cards. It's really cool, man. Sanctuary, no sanctuary's abilities. Target of a spell or ability. It's nice, very, very nice. <laughs> How did we win that? How do you think we won it, man? Because opponents playing on a fucking Nokia and they keep tabbing out to play Snake. They're not even playing the goddamn game. <laughs> Go.
goaded game, by the way, Snake. Man, many an hour has been spent uh, with that little slithery bish. Good times. In, out, in, out, you shake it all about. That's what it's all about. Whoa, the hokey cokey. <clears throat> Alright, since this game's gonna take forever, chat, why don't we just have a party instead? <laughs> mm -mm -mm -mm. That's what it's all about. Whoa, the hokey cookie. The hokey crookies. The looting art. Man, I've come to I've come to appreciate the faithless looting art and even I even I could even go as far as to say I now enjoy the faithless looting art. I know, man. I know. <clears throat> Some uh, a bit of a wild thing to say around these parts, but <clears throat> I definitely don't hate it, and I think I might even enjoy it. Okay, we did not find land number three. Pain. In, out, shake it all about. Why keep a land on top when seeking? Because seeking does not shuffle, so we will we will draw that land next turn. Wow, went matron instead of just playing the mons. Oh, it's getting faster. Oh, okay, okay. Ra, ra, ra. Do, 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 do. Okay, that's enough party in chat. No more parting allowed. <laughs> Bro, how have I played another game with no removal? Aren't you supposed to kill the opponent's goblins? Why did she vibrate? Uh, all the intensity cards vibrate, right? When they're when they've when they're doing their thing. <clears throat> Wiggles, wiggles when it's going up in intensity. Dude, we have had to work damn hard for some lands in this game, but. I think we've just about managed it. Just about. <clears throat> if Jarso stays alive, we've got an iteration. We really need to draw a fucking removal, though. My god. <clears throat> 
two full games against goblins without any removal spells. I mean, our <coughs> our luck's going to run out at some point. <laughs> Enough of this trash format, we need more drafties. Good. Good. Historic is great when you're not playing against fucking cunts like this. <laughs> Ran out when that Krenko was on top. But remember we've got the we got the board wipes. Deal two to everything. So as, as long as they can't kill us on this turn, it should be okay. We have no black mana, hopefully. Surely opponent cut their mucks. We're still in this game, it's only 1-0. Yep. Opponent has 12 minutes left. To play, after playing like two incredibly short games of magic. <laughs> A braid, huh? Yeah, opponent has spent 18 minutes on goblins and it's they're not playing they're not playing the combo goblins, so <laughs> they there it would maybe make sense because that, that deck's kinda complex, but <clears throat> what are you gonna do, chat? Opponent's just a bot, aren't they? It happens sometimes. Where's our nightclubber? I've I've got an, my own version of nightclubber in my deck. It's called Mysterious Blood Illness. Which is a bit spookily named. So, and I seem to never draw removal in this deck, but I also seem to draw like just an insane amount of channelers every game. My deck's a little, a little bugged. Okay. A glorious removal spell has been drawn. <laughs> Instant and sorcery so far, okay. Battle cry gobble. <laughs> Man, I'd love to have that card, but... One more spell, one time. No, man, no, 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 All right, just huge, huge yikes. Okay, 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 new plan. <laughs> Timmy, two mana spells. Brother, I've got 
And hundreds of one mana cards. Hundreds. Literally millions. This is not bad, huh? I guess I don't really need to do the you line up a shot in response because I'm I'm topping the the other one anyway. I wouldn't be surveilling it into the bin regardless. <clears throat> I mean, I'm on eleven, which is a little crazy. Please, deck, just let me bring my phoenix out, man. <laughs> Top. I think Metalhead might finally be dead soon, chat. They might finally be dead soon. We've made it out of hell. Oh man, that was horrible. All right, never again, please. Ecuador. Ecuador. <laughs>